Hello, I'm a presenter of a study named prevent what, what measurement of measurement <laughs> measurement of fear using voice and prevention of crime. Let's look at this graph for a moment. Do you know what this graph is? The last one is the current status of sexual violence from 2006 to 2016. And the right one is the current status of time of sexual violence by time zone. As you can see, the left one is it more and more increasing, and the right one, as you can see, the right one has a And when do sexual violence do happen? The answer is the sexual violence happens during 4, 8 p.m. to 4 a.m. 14,564. It, it, it is the number of sexual violence during 10 years. And 43 points. 3% of this crime happens at evening or at dawn. Do you know this emoji is doing? Yes, this emoji is now screaming. When people are victim to crime, subject to crime, they usually scream or use the word help. And I thought, what if I could predict the crime by the specific specific word or when people are feared. What if I could predict the crime by voice? It led me to the top it, it led me to the topic of the research measurement of fear using voice and prevention of crime. Before the full scale of the research explanation, I'll I'll tell you the theoretical background of the research. The most important concept of the research is speech recognition and natural language processing. Speech recognition is the process that computer interprets the human languages and to the text Data, and the natural natural language processing is is the major part of the artificial intelligence that intelligence the human languages that computer computer and emotion emotion recognition is <laughs> and emotion recognition is the necessary process to measure the fear and this process this process is Led by the the learning data that the researchers classified and applied to the whole data, and automatically classified that by positive and neutral and net negatives. The full.
the process of the study is largely divided by four steps. First, I turned voice to text data and I used the source name OpenSmile to do this process. And second, I tokenized the type words and stumbled words and had words. And third, I I prove third, I produce the data that data that can data that can measure fear by voice and sentences. And by doing this, I I can measure the fear as the result. As the result, the emotions such as joy, sadness, and fear could measure measure as if there is a data. But I found it difficult to measure the specific rate of the date of the fear by one to ten that I planned. And the furthermore research I and the furthermore research I will rate the po specific rate of the fear. Thank you for listening to my presentation.